Oh my god. <laughs> this episode. <laughs> so. <laughs> yes, yes, exactly, Aya. Give him the fucking leaf. Oh my god. That... You know what? Just pick up a rock, throw that thing right. <laughs> All right, what's up, everybody? We are on season one, episode 19 of Spy Family, which is called A Revenge Plot Against Desmond slash Mama Becomes the Wind. Revenge Plot Against Desmond? Yeah, that's interesting. Like, why? For what reason? Because there's not really any reason at the moment to, uh, yeah, to organize anything like that, I would say. Well, if we're talking about Damien here, I guess, right? Maybe it's talking about... I mean, it could be talking about Donovan Desmond, but... Uh, yeah, he hasn't really done anything against us. In fact, we've not even really seen Donovan Desmond much other than just, well, yeah, a couple of scenes. Basically, We haven't literally met him face to face or something at all in the show yet, right? It could also be, actually, now that I think about it, Damien's brother. Because, of course, Damien has been talking about him a little bit more recently. We haven't seen him, I think, uh, in terms of his appearance yet. But again, there's a lot of pressure there that Damien feels, like, living up to him and... Um, you know, like, that's actually what it could be, is that maybe... This is kind of the ongoing theory that, I've, that I have had about Damien, I will say, is that he might actually sort of become part of our side in a weird way. He might, of course, he will never realize, I would assume, that Lloyd has something against his dad, that Lloyd is literally taking on this whole mission in order to secure a relationship there, right? But at the same time, I feel like Damien, with all the struggles that he has going on, he's going to not only warm up to Anya, but maybe even be impressed by Lloyd or something as like a real father figure that he himself is lacking. This is what I've been envisioning that the show could be heading into, although I will say that in the last episode, there was no reason to assume any of that uh, yeah, to be happening yet. But who's to say, right? Last episode in general was... Kind of uneventful, not gonna lie about it. I didn't really know what to make of it. We were dealing with Daybreak, the absolute idiot of a spy <laughs> who was being hired by some party to actually sort of ruin Damien's reputation. Oddly enough, who could that have been? We, yeah, we don't really know. They definitely didn't hire a professional, that's for sure. Um, yeah, we saw Anya basically taking part in her exams, right? And while she didn't have the best scores, she didn't have the worst scores either, either so that's a good thing. Uh, things can just continue the way they are. And again, you know, this is where we get into, into sort of like what I've noticed has been sort of the main complaint for the show is the little progress that it does make. And I'm starting to see that now as we're kind of delving into these episodes more and more. Once again, just going to be entirely honest about it, right? I think it's important for me to point out both things that I really like, but also critique points if I have them. And I will definitely say that in these recent episodes, I've had a couple of critique points there. So uh, I'm going to call them out too. As much as I do, of course, still enjoy the show, and I want to stress that out, but I don't think that even needs to be said. Um, yeah, we're just going to dive into episode 19 here, I guess, guys, and I don't really know what else I can say going into it, so that's just what we're going to do. Of course, if you enjoy my reactions to Spy Family, you can already watch me finish the first season straight away over on my Patreon page, which is going to be linked on top of the description. Over there, we'll be done with season one, but we're also watching season two as it airs, so you'll want to make sure you're there for it. Um, I will have my reaction up to the latest episode by now because I think at the point this goes up on YouTube, season two should have started already. So if that's the case, uh, yeah, we'll be basically at the uh, at the point in the show where, you know, you yourself will be too if you're watching the show, of course. So go and check it out. Your support is very much appreciated and allows me to make these videos in the first place. And then with that being said, let's dive into episode 19. <laughs> Okay. Oh, shit. Could this be the organization? That... The Desmond Group? Oh, yeah, it's a different company, isn't it? I think this is the organization that put Daybreak on that mission to ruin Damien's reputation. Oh, shit. It was a different kid, right? <laughs> my sweet Lloyd. Oh, my God. Shut up, Becky. <laughs> what are you trying to act out? Some Dragon Ball scene? 
Oh my god. Yo, lackeys, shut up. <laughs> Damn, he gets the ladies, though. Well, yeah, I think you want to know him better, don't you? <laughs> for, <laughs> for different reasons, though, but... You guys in love? Oh, this is the kid. Yeah, here we go. This is the son of the... Yep. Whoa, never forgive you. Why? George. I mean, it's because Damien's dad's company is like a rival, perhaps, right? Of the company that his dad had? I figured that, I figured that, don't worry. Three months worth of my allowance. Well, that, that, that clearly wasn't enough. <laughs> okay, Anya's figured out the truth already. What? Are you trying to put the blame on him? You're trying to tell people he smokes? Oh my god. <clears throat> this dude is a total rat. Whole monitor type. Yeah, you'd almost start siding with Damien here. Damn, now he got him into even more trouble because of this. <laughs> His followers, literally. Here we go. Here we go. Second son would never do that. I can't get over the fact that she still calls him second son in front of everybody. Ooh, okay. Well, she was also the kid that saved somebody from drowning, remember? She got a Stella. Oh my god. You don't really want to say that. <laughs> she said that all out. Yeah, okay, well, he's being open about it to him. Well, I think you kind of do. Yeah, exactly. Well, his family does. Man, I'm surprised he's actually revealing his intentions. Mm, it's affecting him directly, yeah. And then they don't have money to... I guess. I guess it costs a lot of money to put the kids on here too, right? <laughs> the groupies. <laughs> Man, yeah, this is what a mental breakdown looks like. Dude's got a midlife crisis when he's 12. <laughs> What what is this turning into now? Are we gonna try and get him his best last day at school or <laughs> <What the fuck? laughs> 
Help me save up for it. Everybody puts a, everybody put in what they can lose. Oh my god, you can't make this shit up. A last meal. They're giving him what he wants too. I'm sure you do, my guy. You ain't getting that thing. <laughs> Look at those eyes of Anya. He's actually got the caviar. I would never do something like that. Like, it would feel so absolutely stupid to put a Stella on my suit and then ask people to take a picture of me when you know it's fake. You're not gonna flaunt somebody else's trophies. That's the dumbest thing you can do. Oh my god. He's like, please feel sorry for me, guys. Yes, yes you are. Completely fucking worthless. Get this man off the show. <laughs> Here we go. What the hell is a choral contest? Oh, oh, right. Form a massive opera. <laughs> I cannot believe this episode, guys. What the fuck are we doing? <laughs> I like like there were genuine reasons to actually feel bad for this kid but I don't feel bad for him whatsoever because of the other side that he showed of himself you get what I'm saying thinking that he that he, that he like owns it all that he is owed it rather, I guess, right? Oh my god. <laughs> this episode. <laughs> so. <laughs> yes, yes, exactly, Aya. Give him the fucking leaf. Oh my god. That... You know what? Just pick up a rock, throw that thing right. <laughs> Man. Yeah, 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 sure, dude. Walk on. My god. I can't. <laughs> this kid pisses me off. <laughs> I mean, I know he doesn't deserve, like, full-on hate either. <laughs> but he does not deserve this. He does not deserve the fucking credit for this entire episode. You get what I'm saying? This dude just showed up out of nowhere. <laughs> We're acting like we just said goodbye to the best character of the whole show. Great. It just got bored out. Uh, okay. Thanks, Damien. Does that mean he gets to stay at the school? <laughs> Nah, you can just go back tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't. I. Wow. Yeah, that's embarrassing, isn't it? You know, I kind of take back what I thought about this episode at first because now it's actually pretty damn fucking hilarious. <laughs> See how all this played out. <laughs> Give me my leave back. <laughs> she does not look like she wants to get out of bed. Oh, she's got Bond sleeping here too. Not even on the bed, just on the floor. 
Yeah, that, you know, that happens to me quite a lot. That's kind of annoying, man. Like, I'd rather work in the morning than in the afternoon, you know? Because it's like, okay, now you're going to be just still thinking about that the rest of your morning. I'd rather just get it over with and then have the rest of the day for myself. Oh god, what did she forget? What are these, like gym clothes? Dude, I would always forget my gym clothes back in the days, man. Mama becomes the wind. Well, there we go. There's that second arc of the episode. Uh, these are the real life decisions. Times oh god she's yo she's about to drop the pot. Is that like is that a bad omen again or what is that supposed to symbolize? Oh okay well she just caught it. Okay. <laughs> Didn't even realize anything happened. Oh yeah we're going for the anime montage now I see. I like it. Oh my god, look at this. Faith is back. Oh my god, crawling up the wall like a spider, you saw that? Yeah, I think I just saw her. Yeah, nothing like that exists at all, and then he sees it. <laughs> oh my god, yeah, that... I know she's looking for Anya. That kid is not gonna be sleeping... ...well for the rest of his life anymore. Oh, this is where they keep them. Yeah, I was gonna say, uh, where did they even have those animals that they showed up there? Is this like a nearby sort of little farm? <laughs> Ooh. Oh, shit. Oh, God. We, we're about to get the same thing happening, dude. They're, they're all about to bust out of here. <laughs> Lloyd. <laughs> It's just a regular day at work for Lloyd. No, no, that's not what it is. Yeah, her gym clothes or whatever it is. There she is. Yo, your. Your, 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 please. Please. <laughs> Aya could literally tell because of telepathy. <laughs> this whole fucking episode is pointless, man. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, you can't make this shit up. <laughs> yeah, man, you need to really have some blind faith in her. Like, by now, he really should know that he doesn't have to mistrust her anymore, right? Still doesn't know about the Master Assassin part, though. Pretty important detail. It's always so beautiful when they kick in that theme by the end. 
All right, guys. Well, of course, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, and you can watch me finish the first season straight away over on my Patreon page, which is going to be linked on top of the description. We're also watching season two over there as it airs, so go and check it out. You know what? I actually kind of love the fact that the show completely owns the fact that this episode was pointless. Like, it doesn't even bother or it doesn't even try to disguise the fact that it was you get what i'm saying like the whole point by the end of it is that like the 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 one kid and i, I forget his name now but uh the gloomy kid yeah he's still going back to school and the, the whole thing was basically like uh completely pointless like i said right and then uh literally with your it's the same thing bringing along the gym clothes completely pointless because Anya didn't even have gym in the first place <laughs> like I will say that, of course, that in a weird way, it's almost like the show just disrespected my time and just said, like, well, they basically just fooled me. You know, that like, it kind of feels like that almost uh, because it there was no reason to watch this other than just the entertainment fact. And that's, of course, enough in and of itself. Right. And that's what I will say. Like, I actually enjoyed this episode quite a bit just because of that, because of the fact that that what they did with the kid and the way that they they held the farewell ceremony for him right and they gave him all the things that he wanted the presents and the, you know like the, the the final meal scene and everything was so chaotic and so creative rather um that i i couldn't like help myself to not watch it still with a smile on my face you get what i'm saying like this is by no means even if it is the most pointless episode perhaps of the whole show i would not say that this was like my least favorite episode of the whole show so far like it's probably it ranks somewhere in in the in the upper half of what i've seen so far i would say uh and so that like that is i will say a pretty big feat for the episode right but it's nice to see of course that it did explain to us then who daybreak was last episode and who had actually put that spy onto trying to ruin the reputation of damien all those questions have been cleared up um yeah and other than that, we're just going to have to wait and see where we go from here. So guys, I'm just going to leave you with that for now. I hope you all enjoyed my reaction and review to episode 19 of Spy Family. If you did, then of course you can watch me finish the first season straight away over on my Patreon page, which is going to be linked on top of the description. Go and check it out. We're also going to be watching season two, of course, as it airs. So your support is very much appreciated and of course allows me to make these videos in the first place. Keep that in mind. And then for now, I want to thank you all a lot for tuning in and I look forward to seeing you back in the next episode.